All right, so this is my review of a Presto Stuffler. Uh, it's a stuffed waffle maker. It makes, this thing is absolutely amazing. I've used it eight or nine times since I got it in the past week. Man, it is so easy to use. So basically you're gonna fill the batter up to the top of the line, then put whatever you want to in the truffle on it, in the waffle, stuffed waffle. So I'm on keto, so, so I decided that the questions say you can't use this to make chaffles, but I'm going to show you in a minute. You can make them. But just, you fill it up to the line. You fill your waffle mix up to the line, to the little crack right there. Put in whatever you want, and then finish filling it up to the edge. Then you close it, give it a squeeze, and flip it over. I, I let mine cook for 11 minutes, but, you know, this varies from 8 to 11 minutes. And then out comes, ta-da! So that is... That is my chaffle. Uh, you can see I put in, I put in an egg. I put in, so I cooked the egg first because you want to put cooked stuff in there because it's not going to cook it in the middle. Um, bacon, ham, and cheese. Does that not look amazing? It's so easy. These tongs are just absolute genius because you can see when you pick them up and just put them right on the, pick them up, you put them right on the plate. And you're done. You don't have to deal with trying. To, it doesn't stick stick at all. The only thing I would change is it just has a a red power light. It needs like a green light or something to say um, it's actually it's actually ready. And it needs a on off switch. But other than that, this thing is damn near perfect. Pardon my French. It is easy to use. There's the manual right there. It shows you. Uh, it stores standing. Come on. It stores standing straight up. The cord right there pushes in, and then the end will clip here. So for store for easy storage, can't say enough good things about this. It will make chaffles. Uh, it will make stuffed waffles. I uh, just I've made them with strawberries and cream cheese. I have made them with a full cheeseburger in there. It's just I made them with hot dogs and made the batter a little sweeter. To, and more of a cornbread mix to make corn dog, a chop, big waffle corn dogs. It's just limited. Your imagination is.